Hey y'all, hey my crush timers, I see to my channel today I am doing some beef short ribs with some potato salad and some um, corn some okra and some tomatoes okay so we're gonna start gracing dig in amen y'all amen so let's um, try to take a can y'all see it let's see that We gotta get the thumbnail out of the way, y'all. So y'all see that? We didn't set our grace and everything. So let's um dig in. Y'all can't really see the potato salad, but it's everything is homemade. I didn't made all this today, and finally I ain't mess up the ribs. <laughs> so normally I mess the ribs up. Oh, Lily, can we bring some pepper? That's so good. You see the pepper? So, happy Saturday. It might be in the kitchen. Happy Saturday, everyone. How y'all doing today? I am doing good. I am doing fabulous. I just want to get the Lord some. I want to give the most high some glory. Who Thank you for. It's in there somewhere. Thank you for the wake up call this morning because some people is still fighting for their life. Excuse me. Some people is fighting for their life to wake up every day. Some people going through a lot of they going through a lot of things, you know. And I just thank the Lord for my health that um I can just get up and and be all right, you know. So. If you wake up early morning and you okay, just, just get God some glory. And just say amen. Yeah. I'm going to have a yummy bite. That tastes so good, y'all. Look at these beef bones ribs. Mm. It tastes so good. And I use um sweet baby rings, sweet and spicy um barbecue sauce. like a feather on the tip of my nose. Just itching. I love potato salad, especially homemade. When you make your homemade potato salad, it's so good. Mm -mm -mm. Corn, tomatoes, and okra. 
Mm-hmm. So good, y'all. The bones fell off, so when I took them out the pot, I left the bones in the pot. Mm. So good. That's a wonderful day in the neighborhood. <laughs> My bad, y'all. Phone started ringing. But I was eating and I wasn't really saying nothing. Ooh, excuse me. I get full quick on beef. Anybody get full quick on beef? No. Ooh, excuse me. That's why I know. That's what I know. The food good. When I get the purple like that. I didn't have my fair share. I want some seafood next, y'all. I have not forgot about the August giveaway. There's just so many things going on at one time. I lost a friend, a best friend. And then the next day, my boss passed. So there's a lot going on and, uh, that I have to endure and deal with. And on top of that, I don't want to make it like no sad video, but on top of that, I'm still grieving my father that passed back in 2012. Some people can get over stuff, get over things soon. Everybody having stuff different. But, um, me personally, I don't know. Everybody grieve different. You can't tell a person how to grieve. You know, but you know, um, 2020 came in taking people out. So imagine how 2020 is going to leave out. It's going to take people out too. And the only thing I can say is, is to stay prayed up and just thank the Lord when you open your eyes every morning. You know, because some people don't believe in the coronavirus, COVID-19. I mean, it, it just, it just, it's just too much going on. It's stuff going on everywhere. Every, everybody got, everybody got something going on. So don't ever think that it's only you that dealing with problems. It's not just you. You're not by yourself. It's all of us. We are dealing with things in our own way. You know, um. 
don't never feel alone because even if you don't have your immediate family there for you, you got your friends that's online, on the internet or whatever there for you, we're going to always be there for one another, you know, and um, that's the way the world goes, you know, and it's sad. But the only thing that we can do is just um, pray and give God thanks that we live to see another day. So we just got to make the, the best of it, you know. And that's what it is. We got to make the best of it. <laughs> because it's like you don't want to go nowhere. You don't want to do nothing. Sometimes you want to do some things, but... You got to take this COVID-19 serious. And you just got to take things serious, period. You know, because... There's a lot going on in the 2020. People are getting sick. People are dying. People are losing their life. You know, and... Don't hold no grudges towards nobody. Don't be beefing with nobody. Don't need. It's not even safe to safe to argue with someone anymore. You can. You know how the people they got road rage. Just for the people that got road rage or high attitude, or whatever. Calm that shit down, because the people that have road rage and the way this world going on. That could be your last time fussing at a person. You know, and then it, it all could have been prevented if you just had to just slow the fuck down because you may be going fast or whatever, but y'all going to end up at the same light. Well, one car going to go before you. Or you may end up at that light that you was racing to get to. It's not worth your life. And it's not worth the misery for the people that love you or the kids that you might have that you might leave behind. Think about that. If y'all don't have to go out to the stores or whatever, don't go. Because trust me, my Instacart be full. Instacart, Grubhub, DoorDash. Only thing, only thing is, I wish we could hook <laughs> I wish we could um go to work online. I can't go to work online. If I could work online, it'd be good. But So I just want everybody to comment down below, give thanks to the Lord, say amen that we still here. You know, because some people fighting every day just to be here, and some people didn't wake up this morning. If you woke up this morning, say amen. Thank you, Lord. I, I thank you for everything. And I love you guys, and stay safe, and stay blessed. So, peace, love, and blessings to each and every one of you. Don't forget to thumbs up this video, comment, and subscribe. So, next time I upload a video, you'll be notified, okay? Mwah.